I do have a new bike on the way, it's very different. All right, under this, we have my new bike. Let's take a look. Oh. It's my Norco Shore A2, so yeah. All right, just got the Archie's house. Hello? Ah! Ah! This one's going in the video. Right there. We'll do the montage of us riding here. Someone's keen. Alright, someone's freaking pumping. Happy for the new bike. Isn't he? Are you excited? We're gonna head out and yes, we're gonna yes. get down to our spot and take out the bike. Starting to feel All right, we're now here in my backyard. We spent so much time doing that montage that got dark. Um, this video is going to be a bit more serious now. You know, done with the silly montages and that. We're just going to go over the bike now, you know, look at the components, and then we'll take it for a test ride. So um, we'll start up, up the front here. It's got a Zeb Charger R, lowest end Zeb, I think, and it's 180 mil travel. Again, 180 mil in the back with my RockShox Super Deluxe coil. Um, so 180, 180, uh, wheel size 27.5. I've never actually ridden, or like, uh, never owned a 27.5, so it's a bit different, but I'm liking it so far. Very long, very, very long bike. Um, drivetrain, a uh, Shimano 1x12D or, which is a little bit of an upgrade from my last one. I had a 1x10D or, no issues with it, I quite like it, even though it's kind of lower end. But something you might notice about the drivetrain and be wondering about is this idler pulley down here, it's kind of extra. Uh, I guess. Um, that's basically there to kind of eliminate some ke pedal kickback you might get when you go off a drop or a jump or something. The dropper, you've seen the last video, you would have seen how shit my last dropper was. It's a Transex one again, but have a look at this. Goes up pretty quick compared to my last one. Like, that's the dropper speed right now. The bike comes stock with 2.5 uh, Maxxis Asagai tyres, so those have been pretty good, pretty grippy. Brakes, we've got our Shimano mt 501s both four-pop brakes. But this bike is very different to my last bike. This one fits into a free-ride category, and my last one was, um, what, Polygon Coal, like a down country, sort of like a wannabe trail bike is what I used to call it, but we should go test it out. Alrighty, we're here at Staircase, and we're gonna test out the new rig. So, let me go as quick as I can down it, and we'll see what time we can get. Ooh. That was a bit nose heavy. I'm also back on flats again. I don't really see the point of clips on this bike. Oh, that was a bit. There you go, that was nice having that travel there. <laughs> I've come, I haven't come down that quick in ages. The trail. Whoa! Oh, fuck was that? Yeah. Oh, I've so much more control, man. Oh, that was so good. Um, so that is my new Norco Shore A2. But hopefully there's lots more to come from this bike. I'm excited to take it a few more places. It's got some big things planned. So yeah, I'll videos like this one in the end screen and we'll see you in the next one.